Were there any, I know this has happened to me, but there were, <clears throat> were there any people uh, back then who you thought, oh, that guy's going to be a star. Oh, that guy, you know, handsome, dashing, talented, and then they just drop out after um, and you don't see them again. There were people that, that, you know, you just thought, wow, they've got it. Mm -hmm. And then they, they disappear because, you know, now that I've taught um, theater students, you know, it's, the, it's when the rubber hits the road, the reality of it all. Mm -hmm. You know, everything changes. I mean, um, I, I look at people, I, I was inquiring the other day about this uh, one, one actor that I had, I had met when she was in first year at NTS. And I oh, well, you know, because her, her, uh, one of her schoolmates, Natasha Mumba, was in our, our last show. And she said, oh, yeah, it didn't work out for her, so she got a social work degree. <laughs> you know, so there, there's a huge winnowing of, of people because expectations and reality are, are two different things. And I also think sometimes people learn that they don't actually want to be actors. Yeah. They think they want to be actors, but then, yeah, the rubber hits the road and you realize, oh, actually, I don't want this. You also have to come to terms with the fact that your life is in the hands of somebody else. Mm -hmm. And um, we, had, we had a National Theatre School graduate a number of years ago uh, come and work for Obsidian. And she didn't know anything about fundraising, but, you know, she was a smart cookie, picked it up and all of that. And she was there with us for three months, and I just said, um, you have to quit acting. Hmm. And she said, what do you mean? I said, you're too smart. Mm -hmm. You are not prepared to sit down for your entire life and wait for the phone to ring. Mm -hmm. And she didn't. She moved over. She learned lots of other things. She's now a very well-established playwright. Mm -hmm. But but there's a reality to the business, and then there's a reality of your life. Mm -hmm. And what is it, 12, 1,500 new actors come on stream every year? Mm -hmm. And I would say... 50% of them are gone within two years max. Mm. And then you hit, people hit their 30s or and you go, mm. I want a life, I want kids, I want, and then they're gone. So what you end up with is, is survivors mm. moving, moving the art form forward. Um, and, and surviving can be a good thing or a bad thing. I mean, you know, it's fine. <laughs> I mean, look at us all, man. We're all kind of fucked. <laughs> <laughs> Speak for yourself. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs>